we're talking about pros and cons of short-term loans. What are the pros? Um, not sure I can find too many pros, but uh, one of them would be that uh, typically a short-term loan is going to be something like a credit card, a home equity line, something that's going to expire in a year, two years, three years, five years. We call that short-term loans. Uh, car loans usually are fixed term, 36 months closed end, meaning you're going to pay off the loan in 36 months. Um, what are the advantages of those loans? Um, again, it's one of those things where you're getting a car loan, you're going to be, uh, that's a recourse type of loan where you're encumbering that car and if you don't make the payments, they take the car away. Uh, a home equity line, again, you're encumbering the home and uh, typically you can get a home equity line for a very, very attractive interest rate, usually prime plus one or something like that. Uh, but you don't use that as a permanent type of financing tool. Uh, why? Well, because uh, you get to the end of the line. There's a five-year period or a ten-year period where you can draw on that thing uh, and you just make an interest-only payment on the home equity line. And then after that five-year period is over with, you have to start paying that thing off or there's a balloon. You have to read the fine print. You don't get something for nothing. And of course, the way they're advertised, there's very little truth in advertising when it comes to these types of things. The banks have seen to that. And so it all sounds good going in. Short-term financing, uh, you better have your eyes open. You better know what your, your terms and conditions on your loan are. A lot of people have gotten caught up in that with uh, even mortgages now where you've got a, uh, a two-year fixed interest rate and then it uh, goes adjustable after the first two years and it's tied to some sort of index and it blows up on you. Uh, and people think, oh, well, I can always go back and refinance in two years. Can you? Well, things have changed. A lot of people are getting caught up in that short-term mentality. We are very much, uh, too much a short-term culture and society these days. And uh, we should perhaps watch less television. We'd be better off.